Well, welcome everybody. You join us here for our coverage of what is set to be a truly exciting final. Formalities are underway. Everybody is soaking up an energetic, highly charged atmosphere within the ground. The teams will be with us very shortly. We look forward, of course, to that special moment. In the meantime, we take in the feeling of excitement and euphoria ahead of what should be a really outstanding final. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio do Dragao, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. Both teams, Jim, eyeing the ultimate prize here, unerring focus and determination in all of those eyes. Yes, Peter, I've been a, a winning finalist and I've been a, a losing finalist and I don't need to tell anyone what I preferred. Winning will help fans remember you for a long, long time, so I sincerely wish both teams well and hope that all the players can give a good account of themselves and, and you've heard it before, may the best team do it. So, just who will seize their moment? As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Cavani. Cavani. Van de Beek. Martial. Aimed in towards the centre. And it's Alcacer. The other side especially adventurous early on. Going through. Alex Tellez. And it's played forward. They'll try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. It's not the game we were hoping for, Peter. I think both of these keepers could text about their respective one involvement. Ibora goes looking. Alex Tellez. Lindelof. Van der Beek floats one over. That's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. And here's Cavani. Puts his foot in there. It's loose. Who's getting there? Is that the big? Forward it goes. Martial. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Look, there are some very good headers of a ball in this team now, and they'll be demanding the right delivery to give them a chance to, uh, to go at this.
Van der Beek. Rashford. He's gone for it. Goal! Manchester United. Could that be the start of something big? Oh, high quality goal. Lovely first touch. Sumptuous second. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And it's Rashford. Out to the right. Disappearing out of sight. And I'll tell you, the chest control was the key component there. That enabled the shot. Manchester United get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Pogba. Now it's Martial. Rashford. Timely intervention. Albiol can get it clear. Tries to get it forward quickly. Bruno Fernandes with a delicate... Ball. Oh, shooting chance! And more, and more, and more! Hot knife through butter, they have done it again! Manchester United are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Raul Albiol. Albiol. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. Well, there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes, but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull. One-sided, yes, but packed with excitement. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Manchester United have the lead, and obviously it's going to be the happier dressing room at half time. But it'll be interesting to see what they do second half. I really think that they should push on and do more of what we saw as we approached half time. Manchester United very much in control here. Three up and cruising. So we're just settling back into this second half. Bruno Fernandes delivers. And that has been cleared. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. And the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. 
And it's Parejo. Rashford. Hoists it forward. Decent looking ball. And he's there to hoof it away. Martial, Bruno Fernandes. Martial. It's the top one in. And it's Parejo. Looking for space out wide. And he's onside. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Villarreal have just about everyone back and central. Yeah, clearly they're trying to show strength to what the opposition have seen as a weakness. It's a safety first approach. Rashford. Martial. Ebora. Bruno Fernandes. Fred the Bank. It's Cavani! Oh, I didn't catch it right. Okay, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. And it's Alcacer. Defending was strong and firm. Dashing forward at pace. Rashford! Keeper's not concerned by that. Manchester United just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Well, the referee's seen the board and he's going to allow a double change to go ahead now. Alberto Moreno to play it forward. Could move up a gear here. Rashford. Mario Gaspar plays it towards the front. Manchester United really have been alive to interceptions and picking off any loose balls. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Time for a change in personnel. Yeah, their position is a, a dominant one now, Peter, so introducing one of the youngsters for some added experience is bang on. Defence has got rid of that. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Cavani. Trap. Hits one! They scored! Yet another goal in an awesome performance. They are in complete charge. How's that for a class finish? I just thought he knew exactly what he was doing by feigning to move one way and then readjusting back. Control trickery. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat.
Manchester United making another change here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. <laughs> it's become a case of men against boys. Tries to get it forward quickly. One Bissaka. Greenwood. Now it's Cavani. Cavani tries to stroke it through. He's got options out wide. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. And in time is up, and there goes the whistle. And so the moment has come. The trophy shimmers as they prepare to receive it. A never-to-be-forgotten moment. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.